Hey, what's up, everybody? Thank you for checking me out. Today, I happen to be in one of the most beautiful places here in Ghana, but in the greater Accra region of Ghana. Yes. Um, you see me entering this beautiful house, right? You saw the drone shot of this awesome place. Now, this is Pram Pram, one of the highly developing uh, places or towns in Accra. Yes, I've said it and I'm going to say it again. But how would you like to own a beautiful house like this in Pram Pram on a 200 by 200 feet land here in Ghana? Yes, you would love to. I mean, own a house in Ghana. I know most of you want to have or own houses in Ghana. So today I'm going to take you on a beautiful tour to a place that I found here in Pram Pram. And mind you, this is basically for anyone who is looking to buy a property here in Ghana. Let's go inside and let me show you more. Yes, yeah, so the intention of the owner was to build this place as a student hostel. So when we go in, you realize that, I mean, the structure, the system looks like a hostel. Now, the owner willingly want to sell off this property. Like I said before, if you are looking to own a property, this can be even uh, a business for you because this property is just close to Central University. Yes, I think this university was built five years or so ago and it's housing a lot of students. Yeah, so... The idea of this place was to be used for such a purpose, yeah, for um, a student hostel. So the person want to, you know, sell out this property you know, on a cool negotiable price. Now, this property is made up of 12 self-contained rooms. Yes, 12 self-contained rooms. Yeah, so everybody has its own meter and, you know, water source. So you are not sharing anything with anybody. The room has its own toilet, beautiful one I've been inside, I'll show you. And then aside that, it has two big wardrobes. I know most, you know, students love to carry things along when they, you know, go to school, especially the university students. So it has two big wardrobes that these students can easily keep their stuff in there. Let's go. All right. So security wise, before I enter security wise, this place is very secure. Yes, it has metal doors like this one, very strong. And then it has a metal gate you saw over there. And then, you know, cool wall that nobody can jump. I know somebody can jump, but nobody's going to jump. Anyway, let's go. Okay, let me introduce you to one part of this 12 self-contained apartments. This is one part. So they are, these are two rooms. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So you have eight self-contained rooms on this part of the land. And the other part has four rooms making it 12 so every room has um two or three metal beds yeah every room has two or three metal beds and one beautiful thing that i like is you know um the climate is changing the weather is getting hot each and every day and in africa in ghana the weather is pretty hot so you have your own ceiling fan and then you also have your air condition so you have these two things to keep you you know, either cold or warm, whatever, anyhow you want it. So every room has two big wardrobes. So this is one. Nicely demarcated. Yes. Um, there is another one over here as well. This is the other one. All right. And then you have your washroom, your nice washroom inside here. Let me show you the washroom. Um, a sink and then a WC with a closet with tiled floors. And then you have your shower over here as well, which is really shiny because this place has not been used. And it's really, really beautiful, as you can see. So yes, uh, if you are thinking of owning a property 
here in Ghana. This is one place you can think of. Aside that, every room also has its own little kitchen. In every room, you have a space for your kitchen as well. Like I told you, the idea was to um, use this place as a hostel. So most of the system or the structures looks like one. So you have your um, sink here. Um, you have your water here as well. So if you're going to use this place as a kitchen, you can, you know, just put up a little shelf where you're going to keep your utensils and everything in it. All right, guys. So I know you've seen a little bit of this place. I know you have a lot of questions that you want to ask. I just wanted to show you that there is a property here that is being sold. And if you're looking at owning a property in Ghana, this is a right opportunity to take advantage. Yes, this is a 12 bedroom self-contained apartment all on one plot. And every room has its own meter, its own water source. So you're not sharing anything with anybody. The place has perfect gates, strong metallic gates that, you know, you wouldn't have anybody jumping into your house and all that. Okay, so if you're interested in getting this property, kindly put it up as a comment or send me an email and let's have a conversation about buying this property. The price I wouldn't mention on here because I would like you to connect with the owners themselves because they said whatever amount that they're going to tell you is negotiable. So, hey. Thank you very much for checking me out. This is a beautiful property here in Pram Pram in the greater Accra region of Ghana. Go on Google and just look at a few things that is happening here in Pram Pram. It's a beautiful place that a lot of diasporas are buying land, getting properties and all that. So this is a great opportunity for you to also own a land here in Ghana. Inside um, the inside, there is also uh, a lot of space outside where you can use for your own uh, you know, any other activity that you want to do. Like I said, the land is on a 200 by 200 feet uh, measurement here. So um, speaking to the owner of the property, she has used half of the land to build this beautiful house right here. Yes, this is just part of the land, you know, the plots that she has. She's used just half to build it. And like I said, you know metallic gates so uh you don't have anybody coming to attack you or try to steal your stuff and the place is fully air conditioned now this is hey so if you buy the land you also have extra land over here yes the whole plot wasn't used for the building you have extra land that you can use for any other thing you want all right see there's a chicken coop over there or poultry kind of little poultry there because you know that will keep the people busy and all that so hey apart from the building itself you also have about you know a quiet number a quiet you know space where you can also use it for any other thing so make sure that um if you're interested in this property just give me a comment yeah send me an email and let's take it from there because this property I would like any of my YouTube followers who is interested in purchasing a property in Ghana to buy this.